Hello fellow warriors against consensus reality. Oh, the morning is fantastic. People noises at a minimum. And one's mood usually is positive, especially when it's the beginning of three days off. And you're anticipating an enjoyable breakfast session at one of your favorite cafes. But, um... One thing that stuck in my mind during last night and this morning, which uh, has been more obvious the more I noticed it, is um, the increasing levels of human stupidity, of drama, of backstabbing of cold-heartedness and meanness both in real life and online and it's without getting too esoteric on this channel um, I'm sure you red pill ragers would love that um, it's all part of a concentrating and increasing chaos energy and for a more detailed video on that which I'll probably be doing soon um, check out my Pagan Monk channel on BitChute um, but um, there are many different things simultaneously happening at the same time to conspire um, to keep humanity stupid and powerless and down. Uh, vibrationally down and power-wise down. And developmentally down. And I noticed with the <clears throat> during the last five years certainly um, with in customer service as an example as reliance on some quote unquote smartphones increased stupidity increased impatience increased false sense of entitlements have increased. I notice it at work all the time. And um, it's becoming <clears throat> more prevalent now. Yeah, excuse the allergies. I'm allergic to this time and place. Um, and it is getting worse. Um, during the, the last, I noticed, year, and especially online, people are, people are assholes, <laughs> and it's only getting worse, and um, I'm finding the need to detach from it more and more, uh, because it's counterproductive to my own growth and sense of sanity and state of mind and it has dealing with such people has no benefit whatsoever which is why and real life as in online um, when you come across someone who is a drama lover go Detach, move away, have nothing to do with them, and go your own way. Um, because these people, they're a type of energy vampire. They thrive on creating drama and chaos and feasting on the energy thus created. These people are prevalent more and more, I notice. Um, yeah, being an empath is a bitch, but it also has its benefits. <laughs> uh, 
Um, but yeah, it, it's getting worse. And people, otherwise wonderful, function, fully functional people, uh, allow themselves to be sucked in by this fuckery. And there's no real need, there's no benefit to yourself by doing so. And it's actually more, most important now more than ever to detach and remove oneself as my friend cave creature would do removed himself from the drama and focusing on his computer programming just like I'm starting to do removing myself and focusing on my reading slash research guitar playing writing I haven't done that for too long and disconnect yes i know it's a drug yes it's amusing when you see people rage quit and go mental but that really has no benefit to you at all especially where we're living in a world where um censorship is increasing and google has been found more and more as more articles and more information comes out what an evil cunt of a system it actually is um which is why from this is the final video I will be actually releasing on YouTube. Any future videos I will be releasing will be on, on BitChute. Um, yes, the link for that is in, in the About section of my channel. I'll put it in the, in the um, description of this video as well. But um, now's not the time to be sucked in by the chaos fuckery. Now's the time to fight against it. Now's the time to go the other way. Because yes, there is a way to use the the chaos energy to transform. Transform it in and around you into something more positive and a more serene state of mind. Now's a very important time to do that. I, I noticed myself especially with customer service, um, getting more annoyed, more frustrated, more angry, more... And I, until one day, just the other day, I thought, what the hell am I doing? I'm letting them... Yeah, th this is the, the Buddhism coming in. Buddhism alert! Um, I'm letting them affect my state of mind. I'm letting something external affect me internally. Which, if you stop and think about it, is really fucking stupid. And this is the time for increased vigilance. Because any little thing can trigger it. Someone says something, someone cuts in front of you in traffic, you immediately feel that rage response, right? Well, that actually just makes this whole thing worse. Now's the time to really dig deep, look within, and... Uh, Find your place of peace and serenity. Because people don't have your highest good at heart. Only you you have that. And there are very few people that you come across online who actually have your back and who you actually, who are actually worth your time. I'm proud to say I'm still a supporter of two such gentlemen. Savage Reality and Whiskey Stills and Tumbleweeds. And uh, these Salt of the Earth people do still exist. Um, but you notice they won't really engage in any kind of fuckery. And as far as the online world and specifically YouTube, live streams are the worst for that. Yes, I still enjoy going into the odd live stream for the simple fact of um, chatting with the people in the um, the live chat half the time if if it's um, if the content is annoying the fuck out of me I just mute it and focus on chatting <laughs> but uh, now's the time to detach now's the time to really be careful with what you allow to affect your state of mind and your energy levels and your energy bodies because it's getting worse. Even my 
above mentioned um 60 plus year old female friend was saying that even she's getting more annoyed and aggravated and she never ever did before and my above mentioned monk friend the one who coined the wonderful phrase about the mucousy hole um, even he's becoming more, more of a hermit I hardly see him the, anymore that's his way of dealing with it and I fully understand if um, if and when finances change I'm off to Galway, Ireland in the middle of nowhere um, to enjoy my books, CDs, guitars and to um, thumb my nose at the uncouth, fucked up modern world but um, now's the time to really step up the efforts of people um, the, fuckery, the fuckery really is getting worse <clears throat> and um, you need to realise that Everything you see around you, everything you come across, everything you experience through mass media or whatever is an illusion. We're talking about an era where news is purposely fabricated. As, a, as an old bloke said one, one day years ago, he's long dead now, I'll never forget it. He was holding up a newspaper back when people still read newspapers. And he says, you know, the only thing you can believe in this thing is the date and the price. <laughs> um, which is why when you do come across such people, uh, really listen to what they say, because they they do have their finger on the pulse. Um, these old timers are fucking awesome. So look after yourselves. Dis disconnect. And um, look after your state of mind. Because no one else will. The uh, Lone Wolf on Guitar, out. <laughs>